Hello everyone, the Crystal Penguin here, and welcome back to Golden Sun the Lost Age, episode 47 of Go- of, yeah, yeah, I just said it. In the last episode, we fought Poseidon, but lost. And in this episode, uh, we're gonna- actually, we went to the, through the Sea of Time, fought Poseidon, lost. In this episode, we're gonna fight Poseidon and win. Uh, items. You can use the trident. Uh, yeah, you can counter rush all you want. I know your weaknesses, Monsieur Giant Pointy thing. Eh, oh wow, he missed. But he didn't miss Jenna. Unleash is cool, that's cool. Fog, it didn't actually affect him, damn. Watery Grave, oh, oh, God, this guy's powerful, he's annoying as heck. Now let's Ragnarok him, lay down a Helinora, use Blitz and... Uh yeah. <laughs> oh wow, Pierce is faster. What? The actual fuck? Nah, I don't know. Ragnarok. Yeah. Ah, oh, he's just spams watery grave. Uh, but Pokemon Sun and Moon are very close to coming out. Like I don't know when this video goes up. It'll be like. I don't know how long it'll be until I don't know when this video is going up. Uh, but Pokemon Sun and Moon are right around the corner. Um, which there's there's a midnight launch at like a couple of local EB games in, in my area, which I plan to go to one. I just hope it doesn't take too long. I went to one other midnight launch. It was for Destiny at this EB games it it was like my my brother wanted to get it I didn't really care for it or st I, I still don't care for it we have yeah I have three I'm gonna do one more but yeah I just uh, it, w it took way too long my brother and I just ended up leaving we didn't even get or well he didn't get the game then but, um, uh, yeah, I have to get out of there before 2 o'clock because I can't legally drive after 2 o'clock. It's not because I have an alcoholic problem or anything. That's just how the license system works and where I live. Or just because I don't have my full license yet, I have to get through the process of getting it. Well, I was putting here on myself. Uh, for you, some meteor. Do you have any items that would heal? Actually, let's go back to Jenna. Do you have any healing items? A uh, potion, use that. Sheba can summon, uh, actually what Sheba can do is use, restore synergy to you and you summon Boris. Yeah, so I hope it goes over well. Like, it's the Thursday night at 12 o'clock. My friend who's going, who's gonna get both games, and my girlfriend who's going is just gonna get, or just gonna go just to entertain us. Well, she doesn't know if she can go yet. She just has to get her permission from her mom and all that, or tell her that she's going or something. I don't know. Ocean Fist. That looks powerful, and Piers is almost dead. Don't Kill Piers! Uh, I can just revive him with Felix anyways. Yeah, I can just revive him with Felix. Uh, you... Revive you... And then Sheba... Thor, there we go. This should all work out well. Hopefully. Yes, Thor, Zappy Zap. And yeah, not much has actually been going on that's 
relevant to talk about I'm playing video games cuz I ain't gonna talk no politics while playing video games I find that's just dumb Ooh, I'm gonna clench oh god oh Sheba died dead let's use revive on Sheba Jenna I'll just drop a potent here miss potion that's it and then with you you just don't have any energy no, let's make you attack I think that was for the best. Yeah, I think this was actually a good time for him to use counter rush, because honestly, no one's attacking besides Piers, and it's just a normal attack. And watery grave. Oh gosh. Oh god. Yay, people. What is Felix's energy like? Planet driver. Uh, ooh, some of these could be cool, but no, I'm just gonna use coal again. You can use... What does Reflux do? Counter an enemy's attack. That is what I'm gonna do. Use... Uh, I'm gonna use Shine Plasmas. Like, what's the most powerful one? It's the one worth the most. Uh, Ocean Fist. Oh, did he use it on Sheba? I think he did. Yeah, he did. Or Jen, I mean. Yeah, he did. And counter! Bam! Giant Plasma, oh my gosh, how much more HP does this fucker have? Watery Grave, I'm gonna have to revive Jenna, and... Oh, never mind. Let's, let's see how this goes. Let's, with you, I'll just use Shine Plasma again, and with you, I'll summon that one, Counter Rush. Okay, will it be death? No, but will Piers kill him? Or pi yeah, Piers. Yes! Wait, yes! Yes, I killed him! How many battles are we gonna have that it, it's just one... It's just, like, one person left and they're about to die. Like, how many times? Here we got a synergy crystal. And Poseidon is down! And he throws up rocks everywhere because he's a coward. He's like, I lost, so I'm gonna throw these rocks everywhere so you can't escape. That that music's still playing though, but we killed Poseidon, we're on the great ocean to Lumeria, and we're finally at Lumeria. Oh my, this music is so incredible. I love this music so much. This is probably one of my favorite songs in the game. And you can see all these other boats that are just like ours. Those look like they're knocked over. Yeah, it looks like they're knocked over, but those other ones aren't. So, we finally, finally are in Lumeria. Welcome, one and all, to the city of everlasting people you can who can live like millions of years because of a certain thing. I don't know what... It, why was what? Why that was synergy, wasn't it? Are they adapts? Nope, I'm definitely not an adapt. Hey, they're blue-haired people. Who are you? Are you the ones who defeated Poseidon? Yes, we are. That's quite something. Who are you? Yeah, that you could have defeated the Luvarians. If you could be strong enough to defeat Poseidon, you are too dangerous to enter Lumeria. The king's orders are clear. We cannot enter grant you entry. Really? We king, who's your king? His Highness King Hydros, of course. His Majesty has ruled over Lumeria for centuries. King Hydros has declared that Lumeria must be kept safe from dangerous outsiders. You say that we are dangerous, but you do you include me as well? Piers! Piers! Oh, they remember him. Did you join them in battle against Poseidon? Yes, he did. Impossible! Everyone knows you possess great courage, but you still are a mere Lumerian. Such comments do all great... Dis the, such comments do us all a great disservice. I battled fiercely alongside my friends. Leave our landing to me. 
You have my word that we shall create no problems during our stay. Will you not permit us to enter? Piers, I know you are a man of your word, but the king's orders must stand. You understand that we cannot simply ignore the king's orders, don't you, Piers? What king? What is King Hydros doing? So you people really are. So you people really take your king seriously, don't you? Insolent pup! Do you not dishonor the king of Lumeria? We are peaceful, but quick to anger. Pup! I must be twice your age. Who are you calling pup? You wish to see Lumeria, yet you know so little of us. I fear I am far older than you. Show some respect. <laughs> older than me? Inconceivable! Er, actually, Cardin, these two are perhaps older than all of you combined. Bobby must have spoken of this to you in Lumeria. Times pass quite slowly. Uh, well, I suppose I recall something of the sort. Another, maybe. But to imagine a moment that these two gentlemen are older than I is a bit much. But perhaps I, w I was rude, and I hope to accept my apology. My ignorance m misled me. Well, just as... We'll well, just so long we're clear on that. But if you're frightened... If you're frightened uh, is as skilled as your wordplay, then perhaps you aren't uh, so dangerous to us. I agree. Perhaps His Majesty will provide an ex an ex expectation in their case. Ex ex, ex the God. Why can I not words? King Hydros must be willing to re reverse his order if he can. If we confer with him, wouldn't he? Shall we speak with him at once? King Hydras has been seeking news from beyond the sea of time. He would want to see you. Yay, wait here. Yay, we get to go into Lumeria. How long do you think we'll be waiting? Good point. Time means little to most Lumerians. Mere moments to us could seem like a lifetime to outsiders. You seem young to me, and yet you are probably an old man among your people. I would imagine that you have probably done enough waiting in your lifetime. King Hydras en entrusted us to be kind to the elderly at all times. They seem trustworthy enough. Shall I let them in? I can do no reason not I can see no reason not to. We won't get in trouble, will we? I will be with them. Now, please let me walk the streets of my own home once again. I I best Beached you, I be beast you. Then we place our trust in each of you. You may enter, but don't do anything rash. If you cause any trouble, we'll hunt you down and exact swift and terrible vengeance. Do you have your word? Yes, but I highly doubt you two could kill us. Actually, in the state we're in, you, those two probably could kill us. Ooh, ooh, finally, what could be waiting for me in Lumeria? I can't wait another moment. Oh, hush, I'll keep a close eye on them. You have nothing to fear. Very well, Piers. We place our faith in you. Then enter freely as possible. You must already be aware of this, but you are not permitted to enter this place. Or his palace, I mean. If the king were to be were to find out about this, we'd be in big trouble. Don't worry, I won't let that happen. You know where we're heading, guys. We're heading right to the palace. Is this Hydra really so fearsome? Fearsome isn't the right word. King Hydros, he lived longer than anyone. He is most wise. While everyone respects him and holds him in great reverence, it would be a mistake to call it fear. I certainly do not fear him, the king. He... He what? You will understand once you meet the king yourself. That doesn't sound too promising. But now, nah, but... That does not matter now. Let's go to Lumeria, the city you've all been longing to see. Let's go on and see in the next episode. No, I'm kidding. Ooh, Lumeria. Isn't this cool? Yo, what do you got to say? I can't remember the last time we had a visitor in Lumeria. Not in a great while, certainly. Yeah, I don't care what's on that. No. I want... No, shut up. I don't want to talk. I want Sheba to mind read your ass. No, that... 
Wrong Sanji. God damn it. More of the same today and every day. Nothing around here ever changes. Ah, that's the problem though. They live forever. And they're, where they live is always the same. Yay, got a lucky medal. How cool. In Lumeria, do you not you do not grow old? It must seem quite odd to those from outside worlds. I've aged so slowly, I no longer fear death, but at the same time, I have no motivation at all. So you can already see the problem here. No one has any motivation to do anything. Which is also another huge problem. Because <laughs> then nothing gets done, and if nothing gets done, then... You just how do they even what do they even eat? Is there nothing by that one? Do you wish to test your luck at the spring? Nah, I'm good. Well then I'll just take my turn. If you change your mind, let me know and I'll give you a chance. Lumeria has no disease, no war. Anyone who saw it would think it's a paradise. And yet all who come to our city seek to leave as soon after arriving. I too wish to leave. I haven't been surprised in ages. I don't know what I'd do if something happened. Like, I don't know, the end of the world, that'd be quite horrible. Oh. Goodness. Wait, where are you going? Come back. You can't go too far. Look over here, this place is magnificent. What's up this way? Oh, this is the palace we're told not to go to. This place... Palace is remarkable, truly remarkable. Who goes there? I have not seen you in Lemuria before. Wait a moment. Yeah, what about me? You must be the travelers who arrived with Piers. Is your name Felix, perhaps? Piers, you mean Piers the Lost One? I have earned the title in my absence. I have earned a title in my absence. Well, worry not. Piers is lost no more. I seek consul with the King Hydras. He has his highness been told of my return? His word was sent, but I do not know if he is re if it's reached the king. What do you mean? Lord Ca Conserverto is meeting with his highness as we speak. Not Conserverto. What's wrong, Piers? You see, you don't look pleased to hear that name. Car Cardin, what do you th that the Cardin, what do you think of... Oh God, why do I suck? Cardin, what do you think of what you have seen in Lumeria? It's all watery and shit. It's very mad... Very nice buildings, must give them that, and statues, oh, they're way up there, how'd they get up there? It is a magnificent city, or do you mean the castle, or both are magnificent? And you, Felix, do you agree? No, I don't see that at all. Ah, uh, yes, you marvel not at the presence of condition, but as the greater, spl the greater splendor of its past. No, not that either. I personally think Lumeria, all those people are unmotivated, unhappy, just, it doesn't feel like a happy place like you think it would be, with no death and stuff, it's just, it's really just not happy, age past, Lumeria was a far lovelier, more grand, and more lively city, his highness, the king tells of a days gone by, of more brilliant Lumeria, long before my birth, Pierce, how old are you, I don't, I have a, how old is he? I want to know. Over the countless years, our people have lost vigor, vi lost vigor, enthusiasm, creativity. Lumeria has fallen into a slow colossus of a city that has lost its spark. Lumeria, as you see it, is only a shadow of the city of legends. That's hmm. If only I had a chance to see the city in all its splendor. But how does Con Conciverto figure in? King Hydros believes that our de dis decay is related in some way to alchemy. 
Alchemy? Team Hydras wants to find a way to stop the ruin of Lumeria. If that... If there were anything we could do to help stop it, we would. But the Senators are unwilling to ma take action. They're stubborn and they fear any change. Senate? What is a Senate? The Senate is a group of elders who determine policy in Lumeria. Lord Conserverto holds the highest office in the Senate. The Senate usually opposes any new ideas or proposals introduced before it. Which is a horrible way to run a government. Holy crap. Word of our arrival will never reach the king as long as Conserverto has his ear. And con and his conversations with the king are incredibly long. Con conversations. How could I mess that up? Ugh. We have no choice but to wait here patiently here. Why don't we spend our time looking around the Mary until then? Like I said, we'd head instantly to the palace. Not listening to what that those poor people said before. But don't go near the palace. Is, da, da, da. is there actually any place to heal? Revive anyone? Like, is there no... I mean, it is the place of no disease and stiff. Oh, this guy's an alcoholic. Are you travelers that came here as peers? I'm sorry, it has taken me so long to visit, Uncle. Peers, you're alive! Yes, I've managed to survive against a great many travelers. Trials. What a fascinating coincidence. We stumbled across Piers' uncle's house. And he has a bird, too. I must thank you all now for looking after my nephew. I can see it wasn't an easy time with him gone. This is Felix and Cardin. They're my new friends, and I've added me, aided me tremendously. If my sister could only hear how timid young Piers had become a mighty warrior... Huh? Where is my mother? We've been so busy since I arrived What a, that I haven't had a chance to see her. Uh, there's probably a reason that all these bottles are just lying around Piers. Now that I think about it, this place is a mess. What happened? Mother's always so neat. No, she hasn't fallen ill again, has she? There's still illness in Lumeria? My mother was born with a weak heart. Piers, I'm sorry. Your turn comes too late. After the tidal wave washed you to, s to see, your mother suddenly fell ill. The shock of losing you was too great for her poor heart. She had only hoped for you to safe return until the very end. Perhaps your mother gave herself up to ensure your survival. Does that not sound like your mother? Where is she now? She rests in the she rests in the cemetery now. Check your headstone, you will find her. Check the headstone, you will find her. She's done more than fallen ill. She's passed away. What should we do, Felix? Should we follow Piers? No, give him time alone. You're right. Piers probably needs some time alone right now. And I... Wait! I ask that you, le you leave Piers to his mourning for now. That We just said that we would. Now that he's struggling with the loss of his mother, he needs time. You came to Lemuria to learn about alchemy, did you not? Uh, yeah, yeah, we totally did. I suspect as much. Piers was right to bring you here. Ooh, I'm bleeding. Oh, God, there's blood all over my foot now. That's not good. I wonder what the hell happened. Ooh. It's not as bad as it sounds, but still. Piers told me his se the secret, the mission he was given to it by his highness, the king. Even, even had the tidal wave not carry Piers off, he would left us. Sir, such was his fate. You look confused. Piers told you about this, did he not? No. He keeps secrets from us. 
curious. I didn't understand why he would do that. I, I couldn't, can't, uh, curious. I can't understand why he would do that. If Lord Conciverto had not led the Senate to oppose him, he would have left sooner. I wonder what news Piers had brought with him. Either way, I do know why he has brought you here. Felix, don't tell me that he hasn't at least told you that much. No, he hasn't told us that either. Did Piers tell you nothing before bringing you here to Lumeria? No, he didn't tell us anything. Unfortunately, I know little more than that. Well, Piers confronts his sorrows over the loss of his mother. You have some more time. I shall write you a letter so that you can see Lumpa. Or Luna. No, Lumpa. Lumpa has locked himself in his tower and rarely comes out, but if I send him a letter, him this, he will see you. Well, he's sending his messenger pigeon out. And. Go. Now he's just giving it the letter now. Okay, now he's going. Is he going to go out the window? Is he going to go out the door? Is he going to just disappear and teleport? All I need is this bird to carry it to him in his tower. And he's going to go out the window. Okay. There, you should be able to see him now. Okay, first I want to see how to freaking heal. Like, jeez, do you Lumerians not have any healing spot? Like, after a battle like that, I need some healing, motherfucker. Anyways, after more, um, sorrow episode of Golden Sun Lost Age, next episode, we'll explore Lumeria a bit more. And see what else is here to offer us. Oh, never mind. Going to the Mar. The door's broken, I'm afraid. But I'd open up a window just above the door. Sorry about that, but you have to climb the way through here. Okay, yeah, yeah. Next episode of Golden Sun Lost Age. We'll just we'll do that just that. See you guys then. Bye.